had rain, all kinds of stuff, so that this um, Yarbo has, the pro mower now has to tackle um, even, uh, you know, taller grass now. So now if I look at it, all right, so now it's several inches taller here. You can see easily, you know, a foot for some of these uh, seedlings that stick out. Um, much, uh, much taller grass now. All right, so I moved the no-go zone to the other side, and now I'm going to hit start. Uh, to tell it to go. It's going to mow the inside first and then do the perimeter just like before. Uh, this time with the pro module. So let's see how it does. This says now it's 3,200 square feet and it says 41 minutes. It's the same amount of time estimation. What I'm impressed is how quiet the blades are still. Those blades are on right now. So, so far I am very impressed. This is definitely cutting this deep grass way better than the razor blades on the flywheels. It's not gonna be perfect. This is still, you know, tall grass and I'm expecting it to be a little bit rougher. It is micro mulching is what they kind of call it. But you can see I'm actually cutting off several inches of grass there. I'm cutting at about 2.8 inches of height. You can adjust it from like, I don't know, one inch with the uh, blades up to like four inches, uh, give or take. Um, and this is able to really go through this stint stuff. Now I'm gonna give this a bigger challenge here where I'm gonna go out even to some field grass and see how it does. But I'm impressed that this can do this because even my commercial 60 inch mower, when it cuts the stuff, it's making big, huge piles of side discharge grass. What I like about the Yarbo is that it is mulching it and putting it right back on top where it came off from. So it doesn't have uh, big piles of the um the dry or dead grass um thereafter so um, i'm gonna let this finish up 